I'm fucking stoked on this one. I'm telling you guys. Oh, man. Sorry, I'm moving some shit around. Fuck, I wish you guys could smell this. Oh, man, this smells so good. Um, this, this is becoming one of my, um, one of my new favorite strains to run. Um, Cinex. It has such a crazy, interesting, unique, uh, aroma to it. It's like, it's hard for me to put into words. I don't know, maybe I need to fucking brush up on my adjectives or something. <laughs> uh, but it's, it's like, um, it's, uh, it's like, um, like a fruity, almost like a tropical fruit with a bit, uh, like a very buttery, very buttery, uh, tropical fruit or, um, s somewhere in, somewhere in there. I don't know. There's, d there's definitely this kind of like funky kind of buttery nature to it, which sounds weird, but it just, uh, I don't know. You got to smell it to, for, I guess that to register and make sense. Um, or maybe I'm just being weird and, and, uh, describing it strangely. I don't know. I'm trying, I don't know. Fuck. Marijuana's crazy, man. They got so many fucking smells and flavors and aromas and shit. It's hard to fucking keep up. And then to try to actually, like, put it into words sometimes, um, it's, it's difficult. I know you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyways, today we're gonna scrape this shit up. Um, I showed you guys a little bit earlier what the trim looked like two pound run of some, you know, like, okay looking material, um, but that being said, it smelled fucking awesome, and that's really important to me, because the smell really, really translates through into the, into the oil, if the material you're working with doesn't have, have a lot of smell, um, then I w don't expect a, a lot of flavor or smell from, from the oil that you're gonna run from it, that's just, you know, my experience, anyways, Let's do this. Just got home from Red Robin, had my birthday dinner. Today's not my birthday, but it was a little bit ago. Got a belly full of burger. Mmm. Holy fuck, that's... Oh my god. It's like Pornhub.com for oil, right her. <laughs> oh... Damn, that's fucking hot. Shit. Ooh. Man, this stuff is like more viscous than I thought. I don't know how you can. See. Let me hold on a second. It's just gone crazy. It's pretty, uh. Pretty viscous, as you can see. It's, um. Runny. It's all good. Let's see if we can get this onto uh, some parchment. It's so runny, so I want to be careful. And I'm gonna, um, you know what? This is what I'm gonna do. All right. Sorry, I'm just trying to make sure I'm focused. Boom. Look at that. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Fucking Picasso with the oil. Uh. It's a lot of oil. Man, I can dig this.
Alright. We'll call that. Um, good enough for now. Um, so like I said, this is a two pound run. Um, so, you know, if, uh, I hope for at least, um, 100 grams, which would be around a 10% return. And, uh, looking at the size of the oil patty that we have here, um, I would say that we made that 100 gram mark. I'll go ahead and go out on a limb and say that we made that. But! If y'all know me, you know that I'm going to be back with the rest of the part of this video and I'll show you exactly how much we came out with. God damn, it smells so fucking good! <laughs> The next in the desiccator. Man, there's a lot of this stuff. It's filling the whole entire um, bottom. I don't know if you, can, you guys can tell, but uh, see, I got the parchment, um, you know, wrapping the whole entire chamber. And uh, the whole entire bottom is filled with uh, Cinex oil. It's about 100, 110, 115 grams of oil at the moment. Close this off and watch this muffin up like crazy. I'm gonna have to do a bit of up, down, up, down. I'm sure because it's just so much oil. It's if I let it go straight through, it probably it probably muffin all the way to the top of the chamber. And we can't have that making messes. It's kind of rolling around. Oh, that's crazy. I wonder if I, I got through the initial, uh, the initial muffin. Looks like it. Well, that's bad for you because you don't get to see it, but good for me because I don't have to go through it. <laughs> And, um, you know, I tried to avoid that in the beginning by adding, uh, elongating the heat stage. Um, oops. Uh, sorry. By elongating the heat stage, um, to dissipate more of the, more of the, uh, butane so that it would muffin less in the chamber and be more manageable. Because, you know, you can choose how you want to dissipate your, your butane, whether it be by heat or by, um, by pressure or by both. And then you can, you know, you can uh, mitigate the percentage that you want to give to each or uh, whatever individual type of purging process you prefer. Hopefully that makes sense. Uh, what I'm saying, I don't even understand the shit that I'm trying to say half the time. <laughs> I don't even understand myself. Fuck. Nice. All right, sweet. This is looking good. Um, it's uh, looking like I can go ahead and walk away from this for a bit, let it be, and uh, let it purge. It's gonna be a few hours. Go, baby, go, baby, go, baby, go! Woo! <laughs> yeah! Finally done with this Cinex. Oh, man. I feel like just like breaking off chunks of this and shoving it up my nose and just walking around all day. Smelling, smelling this divine shit. Oh, my God. <laughs> Whenever they invent smell-o-vision on the computer, you guys are going to shit yourselves.
Cause I'm gonna be putting out some videos. Oh damn. <laughs> this stuff smells man, it's um I really really like this strain. It's um you know there's so many strains nowadays, it's uh it takes a lot to impress me, but the Cynex is um it's burrowing into my heart, man, I tell you. <laughs> it's just got this crazy, crazy, like, funky... Tr uh, man, I, s I swear, it sm it's, it's a weird term, but it smells buttery to me, like buttery fruit. Um, I don't even know. Anyways, got a nice um, 100 gram, 100 plus gram patty here. Fucking... Ooh, look at that. I picked this up. Be like a fucking BHO palette paint Picasso. <laughs> no, fuck it. I don't wanna. I'm gonna let it chill. Till I split it up with the patient who I ran it for. Try to, you know, keep it pristine. Anyways, I thought you guys would dig this. Let's end the video off on a good note.